Hey guys. So today I'm going to teach you about idioms part 2. So let's get started. Off the top of one's head which means from memory without thinking too much which means when someone asks you something like you say it from your memory without thinking too much on it or without working too much on it you just say it from your memory we'll see with a few examples ryan can list the capital cities of all the 50 states off the top of his head which means he could tell all the capital cities of the 50 states right from his memory without thinking too much put me on the spot which means they forced me into a difficult situation or they have asked me a difficult question so for suppose my kids always try to put me on the spot with requests knowing that i am less likely to turn them down in front of their friends parents so which means their kids put their parents in a difficult situations spread like wildfire which means circulate very quickly for example the rumor about their divorce spread like wildfire that means it has circulated very quickly with a pinch of salt or with a grain of salt which means to be a bit skeptical about it so suppose don't believe exactly what someone says to you to be correct accept what they say but don't take it seriously let's see in some examples i don't believe the weather reports on television and so i take them with a pinch of salt i know kavya says she got the best grade in the class but i am taking that with a pinch of salt until i see the results published which means you are not taking her words seriously you just wanted to wait until the results are published for confirmation So in that case you say it with a pinch of salt or a grain of salt talking in riddles which means speak in a convoluted or complicated way for example stop talking in riddles and tell me what this is about please stop talking in riddles and explain me what's going on so you can frame it up in either of the ways touch base which means to contact someone for an update that is you talk to someone for a short period of time to find out how they are or what they think about something let's see a few examples why don't we touch base in a week after you talk to the clients which means you are going to contact a person in a week to get an update about the client we touch base to share new information about an ongoing project I'll touch base with you when I'm back from Ireland. You can also say I was just calling to touch base since it's been a few weeks since we last spoke. Last but not the least, word of mouth, which means spread by people talking about it. For example, he depends on word of mouth, the best kind of advertising. So if the information is being spread by people talking about it it's a sort of advertisement right so he depends on the word of mouth the best kind of advertising that's all for today guys thank you for watching please do subscribe to my channel to get notified about my upcoming educative videos